Okay, so, hey YouTubers, it's your girl PGA Peaches, 69 Donne. I wanted to give y'all a little update. I know I've been gone for a long time, but there's a lot of things that's been going on, so I couldn't really um, give y'all something. So, I'm getting a lot of questions like, what's my daily routine? What do I do when I get up? What do I do? And things like that. Well, the first thing I do within an hour... I make myself something to eat. It's I either make an omelet or a shake or something like because I'm always on the go. I have to like make a shake or grab um uh, uh um uh <laughs> sorry <laughs> a protein bar. Okay, so um yeah. So um why don't I show y'all? Okay, so. Here is my multivitamin, uh, it's equate multivitamin A to Z, um, you know, it gives you everything. When you get the gastric bypass surgery, you have to, um, you will have to definitely get it. Oh yeah, one thing, um, you have to make sure you take your vitamins or eventually your body will start to shut down, so you definitely want to get your vitamins. So, I get that. What I was telling y'all before, I have my um, Amplify Whey Metabolic Stream 60, and it's about, if y'all can see, it's about 280 calories with three scoops. I put about two with my blender bottle, about two scoops in my blender bottle. If I can't get that, thank you, baby. Say hi. Say hi, Maya. Hi. Wait to the people. Say hi, YouTubers. Hi. <laughs> That's my little niece. So, um, then I've also, everything, everything I buy is from GNC. Um, um, GNC, um, headquarters and everything else. So, something else that I get in my blender bottle is Amplify with, uh, Muscle Meal. Uh, I do a lot of weight liftings, um, even when I'm not at the gym, because I try to do Insanity and P90X. I really try to do Insanity more than P90X, because kind of P90X is a little boring for me. So, not saying all you P90Xers, you know, y'all not doing y'all thing or whatever. It's all good in the hood, but I don't really, <laughs> I know, right? I said good in the hood. <laughs> Shut up, Rodney. So, uh, I just wanted to say, um. I have nothing against P90X. I just prefer Insanity. I like a little bit of challenge. So, um, also, I take is my my CLA. She's crying. Uh, my CLA uh, pills, and basically, that's just um, uh, metabolism. If you're a person that you know trying to rev up your metabolism, you want to make sure you get that. So, you know, because because I hate water. Um, because I hate water, sorry y'all, because I hate water, I have my um, Maui, or Maui, or however you want to pronounce it, I have a whole bunch of them. I have the black cherry, I also have the berry pomegranate, I also have um, my orange tangerine, that's supposed to be new. I also have, well, I was at Walmart and they had like a generic kind, so I bought the generic kind thinking, hmm, what it might taste good. Um, also, same thing, fruit punch and things like that. Um, so, uh, what else on my daily list that I have, I always take is my Zantac. So, if you're a gastric bypass surgery, my surgeon makes me take these once a day. She, even though I don't have acid reflux, she makes me take them every day for the rest of my life. My iron, I take in the afternoon because they say when you take calcium and things like that, your iron doesn't get absorbed that well. So they say take that in the afternoon. So I'm very, very adamant about taking my pills. I also take the B12 shot. I do have pills, which is right here. I do take my pills, my B12 uh, pills, but I, I end up just taking the shot and um, taking that, you know, but I also, I take, and this is and this is every day, so there's not a day that I don't take these unless if I'm not home, which I wasn't for two days. So, I also take, it's called Couch A60, now you want to make sure that you get at least 
1,000 or 2,000, um, uh, um, what is it, MG, whatever mega thingy, they're only 15 calories, you take about one or two, you got to make sure you take your calcium because eventually our body do shut down, um, what my surgeon said, and, and the nurse is saying that if you don't, um, take it, if you don't take it, your body, you'll start getting osteoporosis, and I'm only 27, so, I don't want to be like that lady who's 50 years old with a hunchback. So, um, also, I wanted to say this is the water. I still have a problem with drinking water, y'all. Like, I really hate water. Y'all just don't understand. I think plain water is disgusting to me. I, and I, that's why I buy so much Mali. Hi. Um, say hi, Naya. Hi, Naya. Okay, you, but you are Naya. So, what? what, what, what? Okay, Naya. I'm trying to do here. I'm trying to do YouTube, damn it. So, also... I do, what I did use was the HydroCut Hardcore um, thing. I don't really use it that much. I only use it on the days that I'm really, really going to be cardio. You know what I mean? I don't recommend doing the whole diet pill stuff, but it gives me the energy because I stay at the gym for like three hours. Tops. Like, I, and I go hardcore. And my trainer can definitely tell you, even though he hasn't seen me like in a month or two. So I have my own little issues. Um, so, oh, there's something else I wanted to show y'all. Oh. I never go home without it, my iPod, which I need is a new one. I know y'all see all my junk stuff. Oh, if you have issues with me who has to make sure that you keep your mouth chewing and stuff like that, on The Biggest Loser, I found like these extra, extra delight sugar-free gum because as guys should pass, um, post-op, post-op patients you are not supposed to be eating sugar unless you want to go through dumping. And, and if you want to go through dumping for some gum or some other bull crap, then be my guest because that stuff is no joke. So I try to keep my mouth moving. And this is basically apple pie, sugar-free gum. So oh, it tastes just like apple pie. And um, also I have sugar-free strawberry shortcake. So, when I just want to have something in my mouth and it's not time for me to um, eat, I have something like that. Uh, what else I wanted to tell y'all? Um, I got me a little calendar in my room and like so far, it doesn't really have nothing on there because I'm about to start adding stuff. See, my sister's birthday. Hey, Charmel. Hey, Charmel. And this is all my other stuff. And then March, stuff like that. Here's some old pictures of me, y'all. This is a picture of me, you see, had some big boobs, I missed them very dearly. <laughs> so this is also, oh, this is another picture right the year before my surgery. That's my cousin, Simone. She's always skinny. She's still a skinny little punk. Well, that was me, and yes, I was 315 pounds, and yes, I was rocking the hills, okay? You couldn't tell me nothing, okay? <laughs> <laughs> so um yeah so that's just something up there about that um like i said within an hour that i also wake up um let me show y'all when i'm on the go i have my gnc blender bottle so you basically you would this is what i will do i will wake up i will already either have this preset i will either already have this preset or um I just pretty much just take my bottle and I would, um, these, these, um, I'm sorry, these, uh, containers come with, they come with a scooper and powder and I just pour it in there and mix my pure almond. I love pure almond so much. It tastes so good. Like it has different flavors. It has vanilla and chocolate. You know what I mean? For people who don't like that bloating feeling, you know. So that also helps if you're a person like me who just want taste and still need their protein. Um, because I'm very obsessive, I bought me a, um, a body fat... Uh, what is it? <laughs> this is a fat loss monitor. Like, get your fat in your in your thing. I got this at the gym, and you probably see my other um my other YouTube's where I'm at the gym, and that's how you know I see what's on my body. So basically, I had it turned on and see if I'll be able to see if it has. Let me see my old. Nope. Wait a minute. No. Where is it at? Uh, well. 
let's see. So this is it has me and Marie preset, which you know I'm five five, and you know, and it has it. So I do it. I'm going to do it either every every week, every two weeks, which I need to be doing every week because right now I'm going through it, and I'll show y'all some pictures. I'll probably upload some pictures that I was one seventy nine, and now I blew back up to one eighty five. For the last four days, I've been eating pizza and wings and my favorite foods, and I just been a little bullshit sh drinking too. Which was really bad. If you're into drinking, I don't recommend you drinking because Bacardi or any other liquor has um, alcohol sugar that they say. And I was going through dumping for two days, okay? Numbing, excruciating pain, okay? I don't, I'm, I was in so much pain, it was ridiculous. So if you're a person like me who got stressed out and drinking, try to limit if you can. Because if not, you will be like me. Can't even get out of bed because you're probably freaking distraught. So, I have my own little personal little pantry in my room because um, I like to keep stuff close to me. Because I want to make sure that I can have the right food. And I just bought this. It's GNC Pre um, Pro Performance Oatmeal Protein Bar Deluxe. And basically, you can wrap it in a paper towel. And you can definitely... Um, warm it up and it tastes just like cookies like if you're a person who loves cookies like oh it's so great like it's, it's all gooey in your mouth just like subway except for it's healthier and it actually gives you your um your uh protein so i'm trying to go on my diet and when i say by diet is i'm trying to cut out all my white bread so everything that i eat that i used to love is um white is a uh, wheat so I have Sara Lee 45 calorie delight 100% whole wheat with honey. Um, I like a little bit of flavor and I got turkey and stuff out downstairs. And for one slice, for two slices it's 90 calories. Now I don't know if anybody ever pay attention to, um, to any of the calories but when you start to count your calories you need to stay in your goal range if you want to lose your weight. I'm sorry like. Without your goal or anything like that, you're not going to lose your weight, okay? I don't care what anybody say, it's not going to happen. So, also, what's in my little pantry is my salsa. And in my salsa, I use for, um, well, I used to use for my chips, but now that I'm trying to get off my white bread, I put this with my, um, my omelet, on top of my omelet downstairs. So, you like I said, I'm always on the go. So, I got my Nutrigrain um, bars. Now, my doctor said not to go over anything over 16 grams of sugar. I consider 16 grams of sugar per meal. So, these Nutrigrain bars are about 12 grams of sugar. And, and, and for me, I don't know how about y'all, but for me, it doesn't bother me 12 grams of sugar per um, bar. So, don't try to overindulge or however. I love, and also what's in here is my Quaker Oats. Ah, and there go Bob, my second most favorite trainer, Bob. So, besides <laughs> Chili and Michaels. So, I have my oatmeal in the days where I just want something warm. So, and oatmeal is about, which I can't see, it's about 130 calories and the sugar is about 12. So, try to keep it under, like I said, 16, no more than in the 20, no more than 20, okay? Because you're going to get yourself sick. Um, I've been realizing, like, seeing that commercial with Progresso, where they're eating a soup a day and all that other stuff. So, I've been trying to eat that at night, because I'm still struggling with eating um, late. I have to have something to eat um, in my stomach at night, or I just go crazy. So, last night, I had my little episode, so I had a banana with peanut butter. And it actually made me feel better, and some um, grapes. So, that kind of helps. If that helps you, you know, it helps me. Uh, so just more fruit, the sugar free, and this is supposed to be, um, I forgot. Uh, <laughs> I have the applesauce with no sugar added. I have those, um, no sugar, anything, anything no sugar, and you put your own flavor to. And I will show you that on my next thing, because I think I'm only about like 15 minutes on this video. So I will show you all more. I, canola oil. What else? Canola oil is the best. I can't tell you to see it. Do not use, um, do not use, um, shoot. Do not use vegetable oil. <laughs> so, that's just bad kind of oil. Hold on. 